गुड आफ्टरनून आई एम अतुल वाटपाड़े फ्रॉम के के वाघ पॉलिटेक्निक नासिक महाराष्ट्र हेड ऑफ द डिपार्टमेंट साइंस टुडे वी हैव टू डिस्कस अबाउट मेजरमेंट मेजरमेंट इज इंपॉर्टेंट पार्ट इन साइंस एंड इंजीनियरिंग हियर जनरल डिस्कशन फर्स्ट about measurement it is comparison of any physical quantity with its standard unit is called as measurement this one is simple definition of measurement we can define many ways then why measurement is required or need of measurement measurement is necessary in engineering as well as science as well as research every part industry then second thing measurement is used by scientist for understanding natural phenomena then the physics is study of natural phenomena that a measurement is important part and it is by society for transacting business then measurement is used by engineers for practical purpose and one important part to establish relation between different physical quantities measurement is necessary and last one last point to verify different laws experiments are performed while performing experiments to measure various quantities measurement is required then next is next is physical quantity all physical quantity in terms of which laws of physics are described next thing also i shown about physical quantities and unit i have to uh, explain that topics also then here there are two types of physical quantity one is fundamental quantities and other one is derived quantities this all things we have to discuss neatly fundamental quantity means physical quantity which are independent to each other are called as fundamental quantities or in other word that quantities are invariant or independent on each other then example length mass time temperature electric current luminous intensity amount of substance these are example of fundamental physical quantities then second one is derived physical quantities those physical quantities which are derived from fundamental quantities are called as derived quantities now here many example velocity acceleration energy force or many many so um, momentum frequency for example momentum mass into velocity frequency 1 upon period now here these physical quantities are derived from fundamental physical quantity and just i showed this slide also uh, then now we have to discuss in detail here unit units measurement of any physical quantity involves comparison of the quantity to be measured with a certain basic or reference standard the reference standard of measurement is called as unit see now we will take uh, fundamental unit as a example 
for example length unit of length is kilometer unit of length is meter unit of length is centimeter now if we say distance between nasik and chalgaon approximately 220 kilometers kilometer is unit of length and 220 is number uh, that thing we will again discuss now we have to discuss about requirement of a good unit and it should be a standard one definite amount of physical quantity is taken as its standard unit second point the standard unit should be easily available third point the standard unit should be easily reproducible fourth point the standard unit should be invariable it should not be changed see one example i am always giving in class uh, mass is invariable if we take mass of anything on earth moon or jupiter it will be same but weight it will be different like that the standard unit should be easily comparable with other like that i told 1 meter it is equal to 100 centimeter the standard units should not be perishable the stand, standard unit should not be change anywhere and the standard unit should be internationally accepted see here there are fundamental saving physical quantity with their unit now unit of fundamental physical quantity is called as fundamental unit means meter is fundamental unit those physical quantity which are independent to which other are called fundamental quantities as their units are called fundamental units now here there are seven fundamental physical quantities length mass time thermodynamic temperature electric current luminous intensity and amount of substance these seven are called as fundamental physical quantity they are not depend on other quantity now first quantity length unit is unit is meter and second mass unit is kilogram third time unit is second fourth temperature now this one all are SI units ampere ampere is unit of electric current Kelvin is unit of thermodynamic temperature candela is unit of luminous intensity and finally mole is unit of amount of substance here symbols are given that symbol you have seen now some symbol by the name of scientist ampere and now these two are supplementary fundamental physical quantities plain angle and solid angle and their units radian and steradian now radian and steradian are two supplementary fundamental unit it is not fundamental unit it is supplementary fundamental unit okay now next one is derived physical quantity 
next one is derived physical quantity that we will see in next lecture thank you very much it's